Hey guys, I did say I would be back, uh, and here I am, back, recording videos, starting up my YouTube channel again, uh, but it is going to be a little bit different now, and I know I've said that in the past, but I'm actually going through uh, a name change and I guess direction change for the uh, for the YouTube channel, which I'm really, really excited about. It's not going to be heaps dissimilar to what I was doing before, but uh, I'm kind of opening myself up a bit more to kind of create content that I enjoy uh, and hopefully you guys will enjoy too. Yeah, in this short video I'm just going to discuss basically what to expect from the uh, YouTube channel in the future, uh, what sorts of videos and stuff like that, uh, the name change and uh, yeah, basically what to look forward to. So if you're returning from my Ben Bryant Media channel, thank you very much. Uh, if you're new here, uh, stay tuned to future videos. I've got a few that I'm working on at once so I can kind of release them uh, one after the other. So yeah, it's it's going to be fun and I'm going to really try and put my all into it now that uh, my life has opened up a little bit, uh, which is good. So guys, when I uh, last left off of you guys, my announcement video, uh, I, you know, I did say that I was stepping away from Ben Bryant Media uh, from both a content uh, perspective and also professional photography um, perspective. Uh, and what I mean by that was uh, basically my wife and I fell pregnant. We we're expecting our, uh, our firstborn uh, to arrive. That piled on with needing to work. I've got a day job and also really wanting to push forward with my uh, music career. Uh, the content and the professional photography kind of had to had to go. Uh, not to say that I didn't enjoy it and didn't love it, but yeah, it, there needed to be a gap in my life so I could prepare for the next step. Uh, but that's all calmed down now, which is great. Uh, still working full time. Uh, actually got a promotion recently, which is really, really good. Uh, the band is full steam ahead as well. Uh, we're looking at announcing some shows soon uh, and bringing out a single soon, which is really, really good. It was sounding really, really, really good. We're, we're all very, very excited and happy with the progress that we made with December's deadline. So uh, watch out for that. Uh, I'll obviously link that channel uh, down below as well. Uh, and of course, uh, we had our baby. Um, little Hayley Bryant was born on the 15th of uh, June. Uh, I've got a tattoo there, so I should never forget it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it was great. She's amazing. It's actually been seven months later now, so uh, she's phenomenal. She's actually sleeping at the moment, so uh, yeah, it's awesome. Both my wife and I are super, super stoked. Uh, but yeah, I wanted to give myself that little bit of um, leeway to step back a bit uh, and focus on those couple of things. But now I'm back in front of you guys and um, more ready than ever and more excited than ever, so... Yeah, uh, so like I said, the, there's going to be a new channel name and a new direction. Uh, basically, my new direction is, I was having a think about it, uh, and I saw this image of an actual uh, a neon sign uh, that someone was selling uh, with some cool artwork on it and a phrase on there, and it really, really stuck with me. And that phrase was, is this art? Now, art is really, really, uh, what's the word for it? It's up to interpretation, basically. Uh, what some people consider art, other people might, and those people might consider something else art, but the other people didn't. Uh, and basically, I thought this would be a really, really good premise for a YouTube channel. Uh, not that I'm going to start like a documentary series going around, is this art? Is this art? Is this art? You know, the meme with the butterfly and the dude? <laughs> I'll put a screenshot of it up there. <laughs> My bad jokes didn't go anywhere, so... You stuck with me. Uh, so yeah, basically what I mean by that for the YouTube channel is uh, I I wanted to have a bit more freedom to do whatever I wanted to do. Because with Ben Bryant Media, it was definitely more, I felt like I had to do more photography based things or videography or camera gear and stuff like that. Uh, I obviously did a little bit of music stuff on there, but it, that stuff kind of stood out like a sore thumb because it was very, very far separated from the rest of the stuff. Now, most people uh, would probably prefer to have a channel dedicated to one thing, and I tried that, but I found I was just getting bored with it. Uh, and obviously, to upkeep on those sort of con that sort of content, I'd have to be booking heaps of stuff to give behind the scenes on. Uh, I'd have to be purchasing new gear to do reviews on and stuff like that. Uh, and yeah, like I said, I just got burnt out from a little bit. Uh, I got bored from it. 
I'd sit down in front of the camera and just not have any sort of drive to talk. Uh, so basically with this YouTube channel and that phrase, is this art, what that means is it gives me freedom to kind of do whatever I like. Because when you think about art, there isn't a real, you know, definitive thing or object it is. To me in my mind, art is anything that you're creating from an idea and you're creating it, whether that be with your hands, on a computer, anything like that. So, to go into that further, photography is obviously a very, very big one, videography and film. Uh, another one would be even something like cooking or painting, obviously, or graffiti or something like that. Uh, and it, it, even, even when you look at gaming and stuff like that, the people that are gaming and creating those videos and content, they create, content is art, really, uh, at the end of the day. Any form of content that someone films with a camera and puts it on YouTube is a form of art. So I, I don't know if you guys really understand or know where I'm uh, where I'm going with this. Uh, another thing, obviously, to add is music, which is a big thing. But what I want to do is be able to have a space and a YouTube channel that I can put my musical content up there. I can share stuff from the band. I can share playthroughs uh, and you know new guitar or studio gear or anything like that. But then in turn, I can obviously do some photography stuff, uh, like I have done in the past, uh, which I don't have heaps and heaps and heaps of plans for that, but there will obviously be some form of stuff like that, because I do really, really like photography, and I especially love film. Uh, another thing is just doing all-round general vlogs, because a vlog is a form of art, especially some people put a lot of effort into it. Uh, obviously, you know, the main ones, but uh, yeah, a lot of people put a lot of effort into vlogs, so there'll be uh, a lot more vlogs coming at you, which is really, really good. Uh, both, you know, just going day-to-day -day stuff, going out, um, going for driving or something like that, or behind-the-scenes stuff for anything with the band, which kind of touches on the music and vlog thing. Uh, but, like, also gaming. Like I said before, gaming. I love playing games. I absolutely love it, and I've always wanted to film that content but I just didn't feel like I had the space to do it. Yeah, that it kind of gives me that freedom. Uh, I might even go all into it and start doing cooking stuff because I love cooking as well. I love creating flavours and meals. So I do have some ideas for that that I could potentially uh, put up here as well. So it may seem like it's just my excuse to kind of put whatever, anything and everything on the YouTube channel but I am being picky with some things. Uh, it does have to kind of fall in that realm of is this art, uh, but also I'm giving myself a lot more breathing space for creating content and doing, you know, whatever I like, kind of, uh, which to me, when I watch YouTubers uh, or people on Instagram and stuff like that, uh, when they are enjoying what they're doing and they're really, really passionate about it, the content is always tenfold better. So applying that to myself as well, if I start filming videos and doing content that I love, of subject matter that I love, uh, it's it's naturally going to come out a better product, uh, which rather than just sitting down and going, oh, I haven't done a video in a while, uh, let's pick up this lens and talk about it for 10 minutes and everybody gets bored, because uh, you've seen that video 10 times. So, uh, yeah, I, I, I'm really, really excited for it. I, I hope you guys are happy to stick around and watch it. It also means that I might get uh, different sort of audiences and viewers coming in because I'm not just doing the one thing. I am doing all these little separate things, posting it on the one channel. So hopefully it'll bring a lot more viewers in, which is obviously ideal and great because we all need that ego boost. Just wanted this to be a short one. Hopefully I haven't rambled too much. I'll probably cut half of it out, but that's okay. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Uh, and obviously, the name is next, what, what am I going to call it? So, uh, without further ado, my name's Ben, this is Is This Art, and this is my new intro. Catch you in the next one. See ya.